right, so we uh, got a good introduction to the company there. Uh, we'd like to bring our next speaker up who is going to be talking about investment opportunities in Southeast Turkey. This is the Karakadog Development Agency, which has just got an absolutely spectacular range of incentives to bring people in uh, and bring them into the region and help them to set up business. Today, we welcome Dr. Hassan Moral, who is the Secretary General from the Development Agency. So please, sir, the floor is yours. Thank you very much. Uh, yes, we have a video. Would you like to we, we'll run your video to begin? First of all, video. Video. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's movie time. Here we go. The city where history began, Shanli Urfa. Why invest in Shanli Urfa? Its geographical and strategic location, its fertile soil, and all the opportunities it offers to make Shanli Urfa a remarkable center of attraction. What you produce in Shanli Urfa reaches 10 million consumers after only three hour land trip. Expanding the circle means reaching 650 million consumers within neighboring countries and that consumer mass means an export volume of 1 trillion US dollars. What you produce in Shanghai Ufa reaches Mersin Port after just a four hour trip on a wide international highway roads and gets delivered to many destinations you want by sea. Also, there's an ongoing railway construction which connects with all national and international lines and passes by organized industrial zones. In Shanghai Ufa, of course, the airport has cargo and logistic infrastructure and has regular flights to Ankara and Istanbul every day. Business people, students and working people can come and go in the same day. Shanli Urfa is a city that has several energy production opportunities with agricultural and animal waste and endless natural energy resources with geothermal resources. It's great potential along with the region's six support that provides the highest level of state aid, offers investors some attractive opportunities. What does the support include? VAT exemption, customs exemption, tax relief, insurance support, income tax withholding support, interest rate cut, investment site allocation. Who have used these opportunities? Turkcell, Pinar, ETI, ISS, NCC, Limac, Hilton, Dedemann, AXA Energy, Rubenis, Namet, Zilan, Harkon Plastic, Ozak Textile. They all invested in Shangrufa and they all have won. Now it is your turn. Karajajar Development Agency. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, it's a great honor for me to have uh, this great organization to speak at this great uh, organization. This is my agenda. Uh, my presentation, Investment Opportunities in Diyarbakir and Şanlıurfa, uh, is a very significant one in terms of both investment climate and recognition of the region. The crux of founding development uh, agencies is to develop an institutional mechanism to implement the regional development policies at local level. Development agencies are considered to be one of the most important implementation tools for eliminating inter-regional imbalances and facilitating uh, internal uh, resource-based regional development. Currently, there are 26 development agencies in Turkey, and Karajda Development Agency is one of them. The Ministry of Development is responsible for the coordination of development agencies. The Arbakra and Şanlıurfa Investment Support Offices affiliated with uh, Karajda Development Agency, both to promote business and investment opportunities of our region and offer consultancy services for investors free of charge, as well as, as, well as attempt to minimize the bureaucratic, 
bureaucratic challenges that investors face. TRC2 uh, region uh, is Turkey's and Europe's gateway to the Middle East. 230 million population and 650 billion export opportunity. The current domestic market and the wide hinterland are a big potential for, for the region. The region has been easily accessible to the port, railway and highway connections. 3.7 million people is living in the region. Şanlıurfa is the ninth biggest city in Turkey and Diyarbakır is 12th. And median age is 21 while it is 31 in Turkey and 41 in Europe. This is our one of the most important potential than, if you, the, than the others if you compare. As you see in, in the uh, population pyramid, Europe and Turkey are getting older, but we are still young and dynamic. We can say almost 70% of our population is under 30 years old. Şanlıurfa and Diyarbakır are the most important cities of the GAP project. GAP project is one of the uh, biggest irrigation integrated so socio-economic and sustainable project of the world. 1.8 million hectares agricultural area will be irrigated with this huge project. Diyarbakır and Şanlıurfa have 15% of Turkish, Turkish economically irrigable agricultural land. There are universities and technoparks in T 2RC2 region, uh, Dijle and Haran, are the oldest universities in the GAP region. Our technoparks are a newly established facility to host R&D companies to realize their product ideas and bring life to their prototypes. In Diyarbakır and Şanlıurfa technopark strategy, there is a considerable reference to support agri-industries in region as well. Organized industrial zones are very important to develop industry in the regions. That's why we are trying to establish new organized industrial zones and expand existing organized industrial zones to allocate investment place where has ready infrastructure facilities. There are three organized industrial zones are operational and other six are under construction. TRC2 region are located in the historical Fertile Crescent, ancient fertile lands between Tigris and Euphrates, also known as Mesopotamia. Mesopotamia is the place where the history of civilization has started. Mesopotamia is the place where writing is, was invented. Şanlıurfa is not an ordinary city. This place where humanity built its first temple, passed into settled life and engage in agriculture. In other words, the place where everything began. I think most of you know Göbekli Tepe. Diyarbakır is a unique city of Mesopotamia, decorated with culture and history. This is the place where history engraved onto stones with its city walls containing epigraphs belonging to 12 civilizations. Diyarbakır, one of the most important thresholds of human history, hosted a period in which a transition took place from nomadic life to permanent settlement, from hunter-gatherer life to agricultural production. You watched uh, in a short video, uh, we, we gave some details about new uh, incentive uh, system New investment incentive system launched 2012. There are six different regions in terms of incentives. Diyarbakir and Şanlıurfa are, are located in region six, which, which contains the best, best advantages. You can see details in the last columns. VAT 
exemption, VAT refund, custom duty exemption, tax deduction, social security premium support, interest rate support, land allocation. Normally, minimum salary net cost of one person is about 2,300 2, Turkish liras, about 500 euro, euros. After new incentive system, net cost of one person will be 1,600 Turkish liras, 350 euros. You can significantly reduce your investment costs thanks to incentives. Diyarbakır and Şanlıurfa entrepreneurship, uh, entrepreneurship Centers and Şanlıurfa Technology Development and Education Center projects are supported by the agency's guided project support mechanism. Thanks to these projects, we expect to meet one of the most important requirements of future industrial development of Diyarbakır and Şanlıurfa. The other projects that we are working on are Diyarbakır and Şanlıurfa Logistics Centers project, Diyarbakır and Şanlıurfa Textile Industrial Zones Project, Şanlıurfa Shoes Industrial Zone Project, Techno Incubation Center Project, Export Entrepreneurship and Incubation Center Project. There are many important suitable sectors to invest in TRC2 region. Some important sectors that can be invested, agriculture and livestock, food processing industry, textile, renewable energy, construction materials, chemicals, plastic, and logistics. With all these projects, we are aiming to develop entrepreneurship ecosystem to evaluate our region potential with potentials with local entrepreneurs. We are inviting you to our region as investors to contribute our development st uh, story. Thank you for the opportunity to address the conference today and thank you ladies and gentlemen for your kind attention. Thank you. Thank you Dr. Morale.